Hey everybody, Brian here from quantlabs.net. Just wanted to give you another surprise um, on Linux C++ uh, concerning new plot, which is totally open source in C++ on a free operating system called Ubuntu uh, in Linux. Now, um, this is very cool because I didn't realize the power of this thing. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. All for open source, um, and it's in C++. Look at all the the churning demos, like it, you know, for basic open source, it's not bad. You get all the, um, you get add volume, uh, some other indicators, Bollinger Band, financial bars, um, get a little grid if you want, and then you get into things like, uh, I believe there's candlesticks. Where's my candlesticks? So let me show you how it works. Okay. So, what you gotta do is you gotta run in the new plot itself these set of commands. These can be also run from uh, C++ as well. Okay, I'm not gonna get into that down the line, um, but I'm sure you can find uh, tutorials that show you that. But I just want to show you the capabilities. Now, that's cool. Now you'll see here uh, it will plot this little flat file here called finance dat or data. You can download uh, this from the finance, uh, from the new plot GitHub repository. So you can download it from here. You can just basically cut and copy all this data and create your own flat file named finance data. That's what I did. Like really complicated stuff, right? So let me show you um, some of the cool stuff. Let me just pull up some of the commands. Now, if you're new in the world of Linux, uh, fair enough. If you're not, I'll show you what you got to do. Just type in, uh, when you do a terminal, sudo apt get install new plot, and then I, I think it was like hyphen x11. Okay. Let me just check the history here. Uh, yep, that's the command right there. That's what you got to run. Okay. And um, essentially, you just type in new plot, new plot, there you go. Now, this is all cool. I've shown you, and I have, uh, let me just show you. I've got, I made a temporary uh, folder here called new plot. You can see I've got my finance data file in there. So if I load up the uh, shell, um, and the actual commands, just give me a second here, this is how I do it, and it's very, very cool. Uh, let's just do the basic chart, so we'll just do the minimal, uh, and here's the chart. Um, you get some basic uh, controls here, I don't know exactly if they're functional in this particular demo but you know for open source not bad not bad at all and, and again I can um, probably apply my own live um, charting as I've done in a demo with my MATLAB where I have the um, MATLAB get called the chart from MATLAB get called from C sharp this case is very similar but I'm calling new plot itself so that's pretty cool um, so let's do some more advanced charting here. Uh, just give me a second here. All right, so let's do finance bars, or as they call them here. Uh, nope. Copy. Boom. Boom. Boom, not bad, eh? Pretty cool, I like it. Um, it takes a lot to impress me, to be honest. Um, let's do Bollinger Band. Now, I just showed the Bollinger Band with uh, the MATLAB, but uh, again, I'm not gonna kill myself here, but you can see the idea. Um, let's have some more fun with some more exciting stuff. Mm. You could probably add your own indicators if you wanted. Uh, volume, let's do volume at the bottom here. You can't do that 
I don't think you can do it. You probably could do it in MATLAB, but um, yeah, it'd take a bit of work. But uh, on the other hand, uh, I'm sure you don't have a few thousand dollars to play with. But you get the idea. Not bad. And you can do it all live and refresh the uh, chart. Um, let's see what else can we add. Showing the volume date labels. Ooh, this sounds exciting. Okay, let me just show you what I'm. Just copy this here. Uh, let me just put that in. There you go. You got your little dates right here at the bottom. Pretty cool. Let's see what else. Labels for each clip. So let's change there. Um, so here you'll see the labels get added. Um, add a title we don't care about. Let's do a ch candlestick. Everybody likes candlesticks. I gotta say good job to the author of this uh, piece of software. There you go. And there's your volume with uh, believe yeah you, you got your candlesticks right here I guess that's with a Bollinger and some other fun stuff let's do um, candlesticks with the uh, Bollinger it looks like okay yeah that's pretty cool um, but, uh, you know, there is some bugs uh, I've noticed, but uh, no fear, I, I can live with it for free. But I just want to show you that, and um, I'm sure you can find some really cool tutorials, and there appears to be all kinds of really cool other capabilities with this uh, plot, with this uh, charting. But for now, for financial charts, this is fine, and for free, I'm not going to complain.